I guess we just go straight out and back in. I suppose. Where's I don't Lucy? Know. Oh, don't worry, she'll be with us soon enough. So why are you doing all this, Doc? What are you hoping to accomplish? You turn the television on lately? Read the newspaper? I don't get much for that stuff. Then let me sum it up for you. The world's a mess. It's pathetic, really. You've seen it firsthand yourself. A thousand years between you and your ancestor, and society remains just as barbaric, just as stupid. And your point is? Order, Mr. Miles. The world needs order. That is what we're working towards, and that is what you're helping us to achieve. <laughs> you expect me to believe you're building a better tomorrow? That's exactly what we're doing. The human race calls out for direction. They want to know why they're here. What they're meant to do, well, we're going to tell them. And once they understand how to live their lives, everything will be better. Better how? An end to all conflicts, large and small. Isn't that what you assassins strive for? Peace in all things? Hmm. I told you, I'm not an assassin. Right, right. I still don't see where I fit into things. In time, Mr. Miles. He's got In a blinky time, pin too. You'll understand. Oh, you won't. Can I have a blinky pin? I don't care either way, as long as you show us where it is. Where blinky what pin. is? Sorry, I'm late. Ready to go? Yes, we are. I guess he just wanted to sit down at his computer with his blinky pin and not actually do anything. What is the point of the blinky pin? Why does it blink? Is it one of those fancy pens that like records what you write, except that they do it poorly and they cost like 80 bucks? Have you guys seen those pens actually? Actually record what you write into a little onboard memory on it, which is kind of cool. Uh, but it usually does it poorly. This menu is still garbage. Is there a manual save option, I wonder? Let me check actually. Resume quick game? No, I didn't actually mean to get out of the enemies. Works? Yes. Select the memory on the menu in front of you and let's begin. Don't yell at me, man. I hit the wrong button. Jeez. <laughs> no need to yell at me about it. If you made a better freaking animus, we wouldn't have this button issue. Also, if it didn't play that animation every single time, that would be swell. But it's going to, I have a feeling. When you are exposed. Throwing soldiers from rooftops and into structures is a useful way to create an escape route. I suppose it is, except I'm probably never going to do that. Whole bunch of people just joined the chat there, and then nobody said well, anything, and then they just leave. And I'm confident that this is but the first of many successes. Tamir spoke as if he knew you well. He implied my work had a larger meaning. Significance comes not from a single act. But the context within which it is performed, the consequences born of it. Then is there more I need to know? Altair, your greatest failure was born of knowing too much. If I choose to withhold information, it is only to ensure you do not make the same mistake a second time. I see. No, you don't. And it will remain this way until you've learned your lesson. Still, you have performed competently. And as such, I restore a rank and will return a piece of your equipment. Go now, either to Akka or Jerusalem. There are men in both cities who require your attention. The bureau leaders can tell you more about what needs to be done. Okay, what did you give me back? I hope it's the best thing ever. It's a dagger that I'm probably never going to actually use. A short blade, new ability, counter kill. Guess what I'm going to be using all of the freaking time. It's called counter. Why? Because it's the best ability ever. This guy's going to tell me to train. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield the blade. Well, teach them. Perhaps You're the you teacher. Show them what you know. They are your students. It's your job, not mine. I don't care about them. I have to do it anyway. I think I screwed up the first counter. Got the second one, though. Quickly now, man, quickly. 
They'll have all day. Helps when I don't screw up the counter as well. Come, come. That, my students, is how we all should fight. I like how he says that, my students, and the, the people that are standing around it is just like random people or women just kind of standing around. You must be which I'm pretty sure the Assassin's Guild isn't employing women, but who knows. Onward, we must journey another 7 billion miles to our next destination because for whatever reason they decided in this game to make everything a billion miles away. Are we actually going back to Damascus? Ooh, don't jump off the cliff. For step number one, don't jump off cliff. It's a good step. You should always keep that step in mind. It's best step. Can I jump off this? Yes. Speed the process up a little bit. I could cut these out. I probably won't. At least not right now. We're only... What, two hours into the game? Give or take. Instead, I'll just run into everyone in a very exciting manner and then piss off everyone as I ride my horse around. Because apparently I don't have a horse riding license. Where am I going? And why am I going? Why did I go this way? I've become lost and confused. And for whatever reason, I just turned left and did a little loop rather than actually going out of the gate. Hello, horse! We have things to do and gods to piss off. And people to run over accidentally. Sorry, I can't turn. My horse has a bad turning radius. Turning radius on this horse is worse than a semi truck. I wonder, is there a teleport system in this game? Wasn't there a teleport system in the second game? Maybe that was just like an improvement over this, because people were like, holy crap, why does this exist? And they're like, hey, you can teleport now. Or I could be mistaken, who knows, but really, why does this exist? Why don't we just go with the fast-forwarding memory thing and just put me where I'm supposed to be? shows you are being watched by an informed guard. You should blend immediately. Even the slightest disturbance will attract his attention. Oh no! Pull out your blade! <laughs> For no reason. Hello. Why oh, is he running? Because I have places to be and they're a billion miles away. What of it? Where are we going, actually? To Jerusalem or Acre? Hmm. There's also a ton of vantage points that I could get along the way, viewpoints. Do we want to go to Acre or Jerusalem? I don't know. I don't know why there's two choices either. Technically the closer one is Acre. Let's continue running. Figure it out later. Probably go to Acre since it's closer. Then I'll have to go to Jerusalem later. Ugh. I assume I'll have to go to Jerusalem later. I don't know. And I'm apparently an infidel because, you know, horses. I think those might be like bandits or something, I don't know. Rather than actual guards, and that's presumably why they hate me so much, I don't know. Checkpoint reached. Angry men angry ties. Or Templars, one of the two. I'll die for riding a horse past them. We don't like those kind of people around here. Horse riding people. There's a lot of checkpoints in this game. A heathen, you say? It'd be great if my horse moved. There we go. The horse got awfully confused about the situation there. And just kind of stood there. Does this area actually look like this? I was told earlier it is based on a place in Syria, so... Where that village is, but does the area around the village look like this? Where am I going? And where am I? Why did I just push that button? That's certainly not the right button. Right there. Maybe we'll grab this vantage point that's right here. Also pissed off the guards again, but other than that... Heathen! 
Don't ride your horse too fast. Is it right in front of me? Yes. It's probably that building right there, in fact. These people hate my guts, so we'll just climb this building while they're angry at me and hope they don't. No! That is... And then you jump over there. And just climb the stupid building, you piece of crap. Climb the building. There you go. A little finicky with the climbing sometimes. I'm not entirely sure why. And then sometimes he just jumps off the edge, but you know, it's what he does, I guess. In his free time, keep climbing. In his free time, I guess he just jumps off of really tall buildings. I don't know. Who knows? Synchronize my face with everyone else's faces. And then we can be champion face masters for all of eternity. Also, hidden! Despite the fact I jumped right next to that guy. Hello. There goes that guy. Hi, horse. Yeah, they don't like me. I'm just getting on my horse, guys. Chill. Look, I got a horse. We can be horse friends. Horse friends. No one over here likes me. I also just accidentally put a marker. Can I run here without angering them? Just not gallop? I can run, just don't gallop. Okay. Or, I guess I can jaunt but not gallop. I don't know. Will that be considered running? I guess it would. Yes, yes. Angry men. They're jealous because I have a horse and they don't. And apparently I'd piss someone off. Well, <laughs> I guess I'll just start running again. Let's run all these people over. Can you do that? You can. Good to know. I have a terrible turning radius, so I miss most of them, but you can run people over. Good news. I know you can run civilians over. I just want to know if you can run them. This is seriously an unnecessarily long journey. I mean, really. Really unnecessarily long. Use the action view to gather information about your surroundings. It's quite the loading screen there, game. <laughs> I was expecting it to finish loading much faster than that, but apparently not. There's a lot of freaking guards over here. Yeah, it has the fast forwarding thing on parts where it doesn't actually need to fast forward. Like memory fast forwarding and it just puts me like two feet from where I was. All I did was sleep. And then, you know, the... 10 minute journeys between towns. No, we'll we'll keep those in. Yeah, I need to... Don't blend. Get off the horse. Do I need to save a dude over here? Yep. Hello. I bring Huggles. Huggles! Oh, right, I have counter now. Right, I can abuse the fact that I have a counter. Time to abuse counter! I don't know what he just said. It sounded... Moderately Italian, though. I don't know anything about Italian. Grab me? That's rude. Very rude. This is what happens when you grab people and murder people. Then again, I have to murder people anyway. Like that. Do, 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 do. They keep taunting me, which is quite rude. I wish they'd stop taunting me. I failed that like a boss there. Didn't fail that one though. Did fail that. How did you do that? What skill? This heathen will stab people when he's coughing. Ow. Very rude. 
Apparently the dagger slash short sword is OP. I'm using the short sword, and I don't care about the dagger. Unless you mean dagger slash short sword in the same manner, but they are technically different weapons. Is he not dead? Why did you not kill him with that counter? You fool! Thank you, my boy. I only wish my sons were half as brave as you. I'll see to it that they hear this tale and know what it is to be a true hero. There's some weird glitch going on in the bottom there. You see it? It kept flashing like the texture removed or something. And this is true. They are very polite. They wait for me to finish murdering their friend before they come back into the fight there. Very polite people. Very polite. Appreciate it. Also, goodbye horse. Where's the one responsible for this? Totally not the guy right here with a sword on his back and another sword on his hip. Just say a dagger on his back and a sword on his hip. The horse is still following me and they haven't figured it out. Who is this horse following? I don't know, sir. There's just a pack of monks over there. One of them wearing fairly different clothing, but we're apparently too retarded to figure it out. Poor horsey. Longingly looking after me, but it can't follow. Welcome to Acre! Looks fairly similar to the other place, except slightly more rundown-ish. I don't think I need to follow them anymore. You are being watched! Be mindful of your actions! I need to go... There's a thing here, I don't know what it is. Zoom in. Scholars! Right, that's what it is. And I know nothing about this place, so let's grab this viewpoint over here. I think it's that building over there. The question becomes, how do I get up there? There's a flag there. I'll just pass right by it because I don't care. Although I probably should have picked it up considering I was right there anyway, but whatever. Well, this was an easy viewpoint to get to. At least I didn't jump off of the building onto a tree like four or five times. Although, having said four or five times, I think it was only, what, twice onto the tree and then once an, ac an accidental time beyond that? I don't know. Either way, we need to now go over here. Fly like an eagle. I didn't mean to go over here. Don't mind me. Not at all. Hello. No. And then I just shoulder that guy in the face. I just stand next to him while he talks to me or something, and then I just move slightly and shoulder the dude in the face. Poor guy. No, go away. There's another viewpoint here. I guess we'll grab a viewpoint. It's right here, and they're not that hard to get to. And to be honest, I actually do like the climbing, despite how... Oh, hi. Totally didn't kill him. By the way. I failed twice. Did I fail again? Oh, How rude. Nope, lock onto the dude. There we go. I was going to try and assassinate the dude while he had an arrow knocked, just watching me. Apparently that doesn't work. It's disappointing. Can you get up the pole? No, you can just climb over. To be honest, I want that ladder, so... Up the ladder. You cannot complete any AC game without getting every viewpoint in the game. Well, it's a good thing I'm not you. We're going to miss, like probably at least half of the viewpoints because I just don't care about them. Mostly because I'm lazy, but also because I don't care about them. Anyway... GG! Well done, what was that? One of the guards yelled, what was that? Socially acceptable way to reach a rooftop? You mean like jumping off? 
I think I just kicked that old man in the face. Great start. And I'm pretty sure it did. Did it save that? I don't think it did. I'm also running the wrong way. Am I? No, I'm not. Yeah, yeah, I'm running the wrong way. I don't think it actually saved that one, but whatever. Maybe it did, and I just can't tell. Pardon me. I think that random civilian just punched the guard in the face. Well done, game! Proud of you. Sometimes the running's a bit weird. Was that your first death? Yes. It was also entirely accidental. <laughs> so I accidentally rotated and then just jumped off the edge like an idiot. Pardon me. Coming through places to be. Every time I stream, Craig's in the chat, like, hemorrhaging about something OCD without actually being OCD. Why did I do that? You jump up this wall. It could make the path a little bit easier. Saving content, please do not explode. Or die. Or jump off of rooftops. Or do many other things. Down we go. Hello! Ah! This place is windy too. What's with that? The little bird told me you'd be paying a visit. Al Mualam has ordered the execution of Gagne de Naprus, and so here I am. What can you tell me about him? He is the Grand Master of the Knights Hospitality, and surely keeps his quarters in their district. Beyond that, I cannot say. I suggest you search the city. See what you can learn from the people. Tell me where they gather and I'll see what I can find. The public gardens north of here, or what's left of them, are as good a place as any to begin. There's an abandoned market northwest as well that merits watching. And Maria of Jehoshaphat's church to the west remains a popular meeting place. These three locations should be sufficient for your needs. I appreciate the information, Rafik. It will be put to good use. See that it is. Oh, okay. I should probably change the camera view more often in those so it goes to the closer one. I don't know why it doesn't just default to the closer camera angle, but whatever. We need to go over yonder and punch some dude in the face. Mostly just go over yonder, but I'll inevitably punch some dude in the face along the way, so. Secondary objectives, I suppose. That's not at all what I wanted you to do, but we're down here now. Let's see. We've done everything wrong. <laughs> Why is he doing that? By God, what's wrong with this man? What? Why am I doing this? I don't know, but we're up here now. Why are we up here? Don't know, don't care, there's a ladder. That is not at all the ladder, but I guess we'll climb up that anyway. <laughs> really just wanted to use the ladder, there's dudes there. I'll just jump off now. And hurt myself? Nope, that, yeah, don't mind me, I just ran my crotch into the wall. We didn't really need that, did we? We're an assassin, we don't need a crotch. Hello, guard. I'm the most suspicious man in the world. <laughs> Everything I do is suspicious. What do you mean, what is it now? Pardon me. Didn't want to knock over their pots? You gotta be nice to the poor ladies in their pots. I need to find a bench to sit on. There's a bench over here. Don't mind me, good sirs. Just a well-dressed man. Just kind of chilling over here. I keep forgetting you have to actually lock on to people to actually get it to start. You hear about Elaine? The archer who guards the eastern wing? Poor bastard's brother caught an arrow in the throat. Doubt he'll last the night. How can he continue to work knowing what's to come? He visits his brother often. So I cover for him when I can. You aren't there now? No. My family business on my own to attend to. Then he'd best hope the doctor doesn't learn of his desertion. He won't. Long as you stay silent. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. What exactly did that tell us? There's some fortress roof guards absent from patrol duty. Okay. This man appears to be stuck on me. What did... what... Okay. Uh, 